Senator Organa. It's been a while. Building a republic is busy work. <laughs> so is chasing after an imperial fleet. It's about to get busier, Commander. I need a favor. One of our generals has gone missing. I tracked him to Takodana, but he isn't answering his call. I need you to find Han Solo. Fucking hell, I'm Commander already? I love how I'm Commander, yet I'm still wearing the same shitty outfit. Like, I couldn't get an upgrade or anything. Oh, look, it's the guy from Gringotts. The, uh, receptionist. And that's his dad. I'm meaning an Imperial turncoat. Says he can help us free the Wookiees back on Kashyyyk. You seen him? I swear, if you bring the Empire to my doorstep... You know I always cover my tracks. Come on now, help me out. Help Chewie. I don't know your man, but it is late. And you may find that this crowd is talkative. Collect information about, uh, I didn't read that. Anyway, what's up guys? Welcome back to Star Wars Battlefront 2. You've probably seen the hat at this point. Yeah, I designed it myself. Also designed this sweater. I've actually got some big news coming out about that in the next few days. I'll talk about that then, not now. So we're playing Han Solo this time. We're finding information out about something. I have no idea. Back off! Find your Peldora on your own. You two can talk about your stupid beards. So he's a bearded guy. Got it. Nice one, mate. So I'm looking for a bearded man that isn't Han Solo. And by the way, can I just say Han? The beard's looking nice. I wish I could grow one just like it. Sadly, I can't. I love how everyone in this building has the title of patron. I mean, do you want to be my patron? Get early access to videos. You think I look like that idiot drinking Maranzane gold? He can afford to drink Maranzane gold? Must be nice, right? <laughs> So what's that supposed to be, like, Foster's Gold? Alright, so we're looking for a bearded man, I presume drinking quite an expensive drink. Is this our man? Right here? Han Solo! I'm Imperial Specialist Rousius Paldora. It is a pleasure to finally meet you. Shh! You wanna keep it down? Oh, right, right! Because we're meeting incognito. Come on. Alright, well this guy's a twat, says this guy. Not most statisticians are killed by apprentice statisticians. Here. Friends of yours? I assume this is your fault? Usually is. What's my number one rule, Solo? No fighting. I stashed the first data cube at a generator just ahead. Right, well you can help me out. You brought these assholes here, you can help me get past them. Oh, I just realized I'm playing Han Solo, which means I can do this. Yeah! <laughs> oh, I miss my C4. Mate, I don't need to stealth this shit. I'm Han Solo. So this guy's holding a gun, but he actually doesn't know how to shoot it. He's just gonna stand there like a fucking lemon and let me do all the work. Yep, sounds about right. Do you know stormtroopers only land 77% of blaster shots? Yeah, well, that's better than your 0%, because you've never fucking fired any. About as much use as a fucking ashtray on a motorbike. C4. Nice. And did you know that Han Solo pisses off approximately 100% of people that you throw C4 at? Oh, you did know that. Well, okay. So I'm looking for a data cube. What the hell is it? Everything around here is a fucking cube. How do I know which one I'm looking for? Is it this one? And it happens to be in the one container that isn't a cube. Yep, seems legit. Do you know what? To hell with this. C4. Bang. Sorted. Stored near a lovely shrine just through the forest. Onward! Yeah, of course, I'm leading the way. Because you're hopeless, the fucking weather girl. Hello there. I'll just be over here. Safe and sound. You pussy. New objective. Take them out too. Yes, sir. Great directive. Yes! Nicely done, my new friend. Got it! Okay, do you know what? You can shut up. I have to say, I love watching you work. That sounded a bit weird. This guy seems really sketch. Why do I feel like he's suddenly gonna turn heel? Like, I'm just gonna be trying to get this thing and then he's suddenly gonna point the gun at my head. That looks like it's the one. It's all about timing. Um, no, it's not Han. It's about throwing C4. Don't try and sex it up. <laughs> Fucking dump tackled his ass. Wow, okay. IED his ass with the turret. Hey, what's up, Chewie? Wanna lend a hand here, mate? Yeah, nice one. Mate, I really hope I get to play him one time. I really want to play Chewie. Even if he's not quite as OP as he was in Battlefront 1. Mate, I don't care. Alright, they're gonna dispatch a load. Let them all down. Bang. <laughs> yeah, I hear you, Chewie. Hey, maybe today's not so bad after all. How can it be a bad day when you got C4? Senator Organa sent us. 
Take it back, Chewie. This is the worst day imaginable. Really? He sounds like such a husband. Fucking hell, Chewie, we thought it was gonna be a good day. We've got the missus piping up now as well. And we are long gone. Always cover my tracks. That's what you said. Now there are ships over my lake. Hike. Yeah, I'm covering my tracks. I'm doing it right now, see? Oh, focusing on the cruiser? All right, no problem. I have to say, I like how we're still called Inferno Squad. What I'm not understanding is why we couldn't keep the uniform. Like, would that have been... Uh, my bad. Like, would it really have been too much to ask just to keep the uniform? I mean, you could have, like, modified it a little bit. Maybe just change the color scheme. And I cut off the sleeves. You didn't have to give me charity shop clothes. And it looks like he's heading down. Nicely done. Could you please calm it with the evasive maneuvers? That had better be the last of them, Solo. I told you I'd take- Or what? What the hell are you gonna do? You're gonna head up my fucking kneecaps? So there we go, another mission out of the way. And you probably didn't see it in the little cutscene there. But they even fixed Harry. So yeah, I think that's gonna be it for this episode. Starting to really motor through this campaign now, which is nice. I'm really enjoying it, so I hope you man are as well. But in the meantime, I think that's gonna be it for me. So I just wanna say a big thanks as always for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Have a good one. And I'll see you next time. <laughs>